Country Shooter 98. I've got a really old little 22 Plinkster here today. This is actually my cousin's gun. It hadn't been shot in probably 30 years, 25, 30 years. Um, he wanted me to take it home and clean it up for him, making sure it's still in working order, so I have. And I decided, well, we gotta get it out and uh, do some shooting, let everybody out there in the YouTube world see it. This is a Remington Model 12C, or also referred to it as the uh, Model 12C target gun because it has this great big long 24 inch barrel on it. Um, this gun will take 22 longs or shorts. Uh, like I said, 24 inch barrel. Uh, you got your little front sight and your rear, and you can play with it a little bit with these screws, but it's pretty dead on at 50 yards for what it is. Um, little little 22 pump. This is all you got up here for your forehand grip, and it is a pump. Like I said, it's tube fed. Um, I don't have any shorts, so I can't really tell you. I don't know for sure how many shorts it'll hold. I got 11 uh, 22 longs in here, so we're gonna do some shoot here in a minute. Uh, you got wood stock. Um, it's not bad for its age. Um, be shine up a little bit, but it ain't bad at all. Just a nice little plinking gun, little gun, pack it through the woods, whatever. Um, you got your safety right here, and you actually have a little rail here if you want to mount a scope or something on it. Um, I really don't see the need, but that's really just up to whoever. Um, I can't really tell you price-wise. Um, I actually couldn't find one of these on Gun Broker the other day when I looked it up, so I'm not 100% sure what this gun even sells for, to be honest. But um, I haven't had any issues out of it. I cleaned it up. The thing hadn't been shot in 20, 30 years. Um... I ran a snake bore through it, oiled it up, cleaned it out in here a little bit. Um, just did some basic cleaning to it, and the thing hasn't missed a beat. The pump on it gets a little stiff on certain shots, but it's still, it hasn't malfunctioned on me. So maybe it will in the video. We'll see. But we're going to go ahead and go down range, throw a little 22 lead down there, do a little plinking. Uh, well, here we go. Had an old 22 there. Ow. All right. I had one that didn't go bang. Um, all my 22s were dumped in the can. Some were really old. I've actually been shooting 22s again here lately just for the fun of it, and I've noticed that some of them are just no good. So I need to start shooting them up and uh, maybe restock some new ones. But didn't miss a beat. I had one or two. I don't know if you can tell the video where I kind of gave it a little bit harder of a pullback on the pump here. It was kind of it kind of sticks a little. Nothing bad. Um, but ain't bad for just the open side. I started off a little off. And then I kind of found my rhythm, got going there, did a little plinking. I always fire with the 22. It's a cool little gun. It's a pretty old gun, but uh, a lot of these old 22 rifles, I've reviewed several now. They're just fun guns, fun to plink with, fun to let your wife shoot, your kids shoot, whatever. Take them out in the woods. Just a good kick around gun. A um, lot of fun. Cheap ammo. It's probably one of the ammo you can find regularly right now, too. <laughs> so, hope you enjoyed the video. Really appreciate everybody who's been watching, has subscribed. If you haven't, please do hit the like button. Any questions, comments, feedback, whatever, I'll get right back with you. We'll see you next time.